What is up you guys and welcome back to another episode here on the channel and today's video I'm going to be talking about coffee. That's right, I'm going to be talking about coffee and uh, we're going to be talking about a company known as Rampage Coffee. I have mentioned this company I think at least three or four different on different occasions here on the channel. Uh, I'm a big fan of this company. I really am. Uh, not only because they are from Saskatchewan. I'm not from the, I'm not from the prairies, uh, but I really do enjoy supporting, you know, uh, a great Canadian company. Uh, but I really do like uh, their coffee because they hit on three different areas I think are so important. Uh, for someone like myself who drinks his coffee without anything in it, I just drink it straight. Uh, I think this company hits uh, three really important areas very well. I think their coffee is strong. I think it's rich and I think it's smooth and man, is it ever good. It's so good, man. I really do enjoy this coffee a lot. They got some awesome merch uh, and they also have some awesome owners. Dustin and Lauren uh, are really great people and they are so much fun to chat with. They've got a great team uh, also there at Rampage. And uh, as I said before, these guys are from Saskatoon, Saskatchewan. And uh, if you guys want to, you guys can also, if you, if, if anything I say uh, during this video uh, and you're like, oh man, I want to try out their coffee, go ahead and use my affiliate code if you want to. And honestly, it will help me, uh, it helps the channel. Uh, you know, but if you guys want to, uh, you guys can save yourself 10% off of your disc, uh, off of your purchase. Uh, just use Burton Scott, that's B-U-R-T-O-N-S-C-O-T-T, -T, and that will save you 10% on your purchase at the checkout. And, uh, but let's talk about this coffee and let's talk about uh, Rampage, because honestly, uh, I'm, I'm also hoping that I can do more videos like this in the near future, um, but I really do like this, cop this, this coffee a lot. Uh, we heard about them through Instagram. I think it was Instagram or Facebook. I can never remember which one it was. And I was immediately drawn to this company. We found out about them, uh, you know, during the pandemic, like the beginning of it. And we were looking for coffee that we could have delivered to us because most places were shut down. And so we couldn't, we couldn't go anywhere. And for me, I was like, man, I really just need a cup of coffee. And I also just really need, you know, a company that I can try out. And, you know, it was the beginning of this, you know, this, this beard channel, uh, you know, a lot of these beard companies have like skulls and all that kind of stuff. And so I just kind of hit on that theme. And I think it was honestly the haircut, like on the logo, like you guys see the logo here. It's just like, man, I, I used to have hair like that. And then I, and then I, and then I buzzed it because I was starting to bald and I was like, okay, so, so long. Um, <laughs> uh, but I really just gravitated towards it. I thought it was super cool. And I'm like, oh, they're also Canadian. So that's an even better thing for me. You know, it's just really cool. Like be able to support a Canadian company. And I, I think that to me was what really uh, was standing out to me was that they're a Canadian company. And uh, I also knew that it wouldn't take too long for this coffee to get to us. It took like 10 days max, which was fantastic. So we ordered a sampler pack, which was four different blends, um, which you guys can see here. And I was just really intrigued by this and I really wanted to give it a shot. And uh, we, my wife and I, we, we, we really kind of settled on one uh, that we thoroughly enjoyed the most. And it is this one that's right here in this box. Uh, we have been getting this five pound bag of coffee uh, for probably the last like, you know, two years. And every time it comes in the mail, I'm just super ecstatic. It's so much fun. And it just, yeah, it just makes you excited. Cause you're like, yay, coffee's here. And this really has helped us save some money on our coffee intake. So without further ado, let's unbox what we have here in front of us. And I'll talk a little bit more about it. Uh, just so you guys know too, if you have uh, never, ever, ever, uh, tried coffee before, uh, there's something wrong with you. You should, you should try coffee. I know I had a friend of mine say one time that coffee is something that is an acquired taste. And uh, I think it's a great acquired taste. I think it's something that anyone can enjoy, but if you don't like coffee, that's okay. Um, we'll, we'll still be friends regardless. But this is the coffee that I have. And so this is it. This is the five pound bag of coffee. Uh, every time you order from Rampage, you'll get an information like on your order. You get some fun stickers like this guy right here. And then you also get some information on who actually was the one who uh, put your order together. And mine this time is Nicole. So Nicole, thank you for making my coffee. I really appreciate it. Um, but as I said, 
Rampage has a bunch of different things on their website that you guys can go and check out. They got some awesome merch. I got this hat right here. Uh, I've got a t-shirt from them. I've even gotten a mug from these guys. It's super cool. But this is the five pound bag of coffee. So this is, uh, this is not grinded up or anything like that. Uh, we just get a whole bean and uh, it smells amazing. Our kitchen just, just totally uh, uh, just has this a beautiful aroma of fresh coffee. Guys, this is really, really fresh coffee. Uh, it smells amazing. Uh, as soon as you even grind up in the grinder, uh, it is fantastic. It is such a great smell. Uh, and again, there's nothing more <laughs> enjoyable for me than a nice smelling warm cup of coffee. Uh, it's, just, it's just an absolute favorite smell of mine for sure. Uh, but let me just say this right now to answer some questions that you guys may have. So that's the coffee, but now let me answer a few questions that some of you may be having. Number one is how do you drink your coffee? I drink my coffee with nothing in it. My wife is someone who enjoys having lattes uh, or maybe some like iced coffee drinks. I do not like any of that. I just like drinking a nice warm cup of coffee. Yes, when I used to go to Starbucks, I used to get like caramel macchiatos. Um, and all that jazz, but I personally, since doing Whole30, uh, I stopped I stopped drinking a lot of things with sugar in it. Actually, I, after I stopped drinking pop, I really cut down on drinking anything with sugar in it. Like I don't drink, you know, soda, or I don't drink pop, I don't drink, um, you know, anything really with any type of sugar in it. Uh, and it's been great. I just drink coffee and water and that's my go-to. Uh, but for me, the way that I drink my coffee is just with nothing in it. And I also add, if I go to Starbucks, I add a shot of espresso in there, get that nice red eye. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous coffee to have. Um, but this right here, this is definitely just, mm, just drink it black, just drink it with nothing in it and you're good to go. Uh, another question uh, that I've been asked before is what is the best way to store your coffee? And that's a great question. I personally find that if you can find any type of container such as this, where it's got a nice you know, rubber seal to it that keeps everything nice and tight together, that is a great way to keep all of your grounded up coffee uh, nice and fresh. If you guys uh, have, you know, like for example, like this big bag of coffee here, I don't necessarily recommend that you leave it just like in its bag, unless you like fully tighten up and make sure that it's not gonna have any kind of, you know, like, uh, it's not the bag's not open or anything like that. I think you'll be okay. Um, but definitely I recommend getting some form of a container that is like airtight. That way it just kind of contains all the, all the, the, the beans together. Um, but when you are grinding up a fresh, you know, like when you're grinding up your coffee, anything like a container like this with that rubber seal, like you guys can see right here, uh, is definitely worth uh, the investment. But also too, it's just something I think is so needed. Uh, and that's how we store our coffee is in one of those guys right there. The next question is, is how many cups of coffee do you normally have a day? Now, I feel like that's a really personal question and I've been asked that by youth. And I've also been asked that by uh, a few other people. Uh, because we have two kids under two, uh, I usually typically rain, I, I typically go from about maybe two to three cups of coffee a day. Uh, I usually am someone who has, you know, a cup of coffee in the morning. Uh, either it's a French press or it is an espresso shot. If it's an espresso, it's just one of these, that's it. Um, but if I'm having like, say for example, like a French press here, 
This one is from uh, Bodum. Uh, this thing has been awesome. It's been a tank. Uh, but this right here, I will probably get about maybe, if I'm using a regular size cup, I'll get about maybe two to three cups out of it. If I'm drinking out of like this guy right here, which is a little bit smaller uh, in, in size, I think I will get about maybe six to seven out of these guys. So again, I I could be wrong on the number there. It could just be six, uh, but I, that's definitely my, my go-to right there. But that's it for me guys. So thank you so very much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed this. And again, if you do want to try out Rampage Coffee for yourself, go ahead and use Burton Scott. That's B-U-R-T-O-N-S-C-O-T-T -T at the checkout. And you guys can get yourself some delicious coffee. But as we like to say here on the channel, thank you so much for stopping by. And we hope that you enjoyed this video. Take care and God bless. And as always, keep your stick on the ice and treat your beer to something nice. And we'll see you in the next video. Cheers guys.